What's going on guys? My name is Chase. And I'm Landon. And today we're going to be giving you everything that you need to know about the upcoming Nike Dunk High All-Star 2021 and how to come. All right, so first, thank you guys for stopping by to check us out. Now let's go ahead and kick things off with the basic info on this release before we move on. So the Nike Dunk High All-Star is set to release next Tuesday on March 9th at 7 a.m. Pacific, 10 a.m. Eastern Time on the Sneakers app for sure, and then most other sites that we'll go into in just a minute. And there will be some extended sizing uh, for this release with the men's retailing for $110, and then the kids at $100, and then preschool all the way down to $85. But that pretty much covers the date and the time, so let's go ahead and take a closer look at the overall design on these and why you should be going for these shoes all right so looking at these dunks i am a big fan of these more than most dunk high colorways so for anyone who kind of doesn't follow basketball or just care about sports this color scheme is and was made for all-star weekend for the nba and it was originally supposed to be held in indiana this year but you know with covid still in effect they decided to go ahead and move it to atlanta georgia and kind of switched it from being all-star weekend all weekend to just being one specific day to kind of cut down on those risk factors but you know back to the design on these i think these colors play really nicely together on the shoe so as you can see if you look closely the black overlay has some like different details and stuff on there which i thought was a nice touch but my favorite detail is like the mint or what nike is calling barely green the leather base on these shoes it's just a really nice looking color in my opinion and then of course the nba emblem kind of shows up on that back heel uh so it just kind of ties the whole shoe together in my opinion and then we don't really have any raffle info ready for this time of the recording so you know make sure you keep some of those sites and apps that i've referenced in the past ready and then just kind of check them periodically to kind of see if they open closer to the release date but now i'm going to go ahead and hand it over to chase so he can let you know the sites releasing these kind of what the overall market looks like on them and your best chance on how to cop there thanks landon all right now i'm going to tell you what sites are dropping these dunks and at what time so starting off at 10 a.m eastern time you have dtlr finish line jd sports Foot Locker, Hibbit Sports, and of course, Nike Sneakers. Now at the time of this recording, these are the only confirmed websites, but we're gonna leave a link in the description to our blog post so you can see other potential retailers that might just drop them. But moving on, let's look at the average sale prices on the aftermarket. Now as a disclaimer, these prices that you see could change as we move closer to the release, but we left links in the description for you guys to check out the marketplaces for yourself closer to the release date. But starting off, StockX is at an average selling price of $230, Goat's sitting at $290, eBay currently has no recent sales, and Flight Club is at $295. Five. For drops like this, I recommend focusing on Foot Locker, Finish Line, JD Sports, and Hibbit Sports. These sites have a queue-based system which helps preventing bots, and usually these sites are going to carry a majority of the stock. Now, if you aren't able to sit and wait in those long queues, make sure you enter into the Nike Sneakers app. As a reminder, make sure to visit the app before the drop, click that notify me button so you don't miss that 10 a.m. drop time. As for the stock numbers, there hasn't been anything really confirmed, but I am assuming the stock is going to be relatively low. Now, taking everything into account, my resale prediction for these dunks is going to be around $180 to $200. Now, that's going to net you a profit between $50 and $70 per pair. This all depends on which size you cop and where you sell. Should you hold or sell this dunk? Before giving my opinion, I am going to assume the whole duration that you're going to be holding on these dunks for is more than six months. Now for my recommendation, it's going to be to hold these dunks. Now this is because of a few main reasons. Reason number one, these dunks have some amazing history behind them. Nike hasn't released this shoe in over 35 years. And reason number two, it's because dunks only cost $110. So you aren't really going to be breaking the bank when it comes to holding on to these pairs all right so that's going to wrap it up for episode 17 of how to cop the nike dunk high all-star thank you guys for stopping by to check us out and for more sneaker news our available shoes for sale and just anything that we do click the link in our bio and check that out also feel free to comment and interact below to let us know what shoe you want to hear about next but until next episode peace, peace.